Hello everyone, this is our 2019 Lexus GSF with 21,321 miles. Beautiful matte gray, looks incredible, especially in the sun. This is a really, really nice color, especially with the blue accents throughout the car. Also has hints of carbon fiber, like the center section of the bottom front bumper right here. All of that is carbon, looks excellent. This car's in really, really good shape. Front parking sensors. LED headlights and uh, accent lighting there in the front. Daytime running lights. Front end looks fantastic. I don't believe there are any blemishes on the front. No dents, scratches, chips, nothing like that. There might be a couple rock chips on the front lip, possibly. If they are, they're incredibly small. That might be one there, possibly one. But overall, I mean, it looks really, really good. Driver's side front fender. Flawless, no issues. Front driver's side wheel, really nice blue calipers. Love that. Goes with the interior very nicely. Michelin tires. Driver's side mirror. No rock chips, no issues. Front driver's side door. No flaws. Side view mirrors also are auto dimming and have blind spot monitoring. Power folding heated. Rear driver's side door. No flaws, no issues. Driver's side rear quarter panel. No issues. Rear driver's side wheel. These calipers look really good. Love that. The wheel is in great condition. Moving along to the back. Looking at the back bumper here, gloss black trim. Rear parking sensors, backup camera. Let's have a carbon fiber trunk lip. And the clear coat on that is fantastic. There's no yellowing, no chipping or anything like that. Tail lights look great. We do have what appears to be two very, very small scratches right here that are incredibly difficult to see. I'm not even sure if the camera will pick them up. Top of the trunk is in excellent shape as well. No flaws there. Moving on to the passenger side rear quarter panel. Very tiny rock chip there. A few very small scratches there. Rear passenger wheel, again, no rash, no defects, looks perfect. Rear passenger door, very small rock chip there. Front passenger door, no issues. Passenger side view mirror. Front passenger fender. And front passenger wheel. Go ahead and walk around the vehicle from a one foot distance to give you a better big picture idea of the overall condition of the vehicle. Here at Exotic Motorsports, we like to do these comprehensive walk around videos to give our out of state buyers the confidence and peace of mind they need to purchase a vehicle from a site unseen if they choose to do so. Walking around a vehicle from a one foot distance is a lot more indicative of what you might notice on a day to day basis and helps to separate the larger, more obvious flaws from the smaller, less significant ones, helping to give you a more accurate representation of the overall condition of the vehicle. This is a really nice GSF just objectively, not even my opinion. It has almost no flaws on it anywhere. The color combo is incredible. The matte gray looks so nice, especially, um, you know, with the overcast sky and the sun kind of glancing off the side of it here. It looks so, so good. And the blue on the interior also really pops. So here's the interior, looking at the door panel. We have the blue carbon inlays, the blue contrast stitching. Everything else is black. Let's have Alcantara on the side there as well. One touch windows for all four doors, power locks, power folding, auto dimming, blind spot monitoring, heated side view mirrors, uh, heated and cooled power adjustable memory seats with perforated leather, contrast stitching. 
These seats are really cool. I definitely love what Lexus did with that. Steering wheel also looks great. We got some blue carbon and blue Alcantara accenting to kind of tie it all together. Just a really busy, vibrant interior, but not to the point where it's like obnoxiously blue. I think they left enough of it, you know, like a darker color to keep it from being overbearing. But it still has a very clear theme throughout the car. And I like that they were able to pull that off without completely overdoing it. Push button start, fires right up. Seat automatically slides me into position. The steering wheel adjusts. It does have a power telescoping and tilt steering wheel. No warnings on the gauge cluster, except for the pesky key battery. And we can have that sorted out for you before the car is sold. Navigation, Bluetooth, dual zone automatic climate control, heated and cooled seats for the front two. Different driving modes, shifter for the six speed auto. Infotainment controls there. Cup holder here. Heads up display as well. Dash is really nice. I do like the Alcantara across there. It does have the Mark Levinson premium audio as well. We've got a frameless auto dimming rear view mirror with universal garage door remotes. Sunroof. Passenger seat and door panel are in perfect condition. I mean, there's really no flaws in the interior. There's no scratches anywhere, nothing like that. Steering wheel is in pristine condition. None of the buttons have had the markings worn off or even show any kind of visible wear. Uh, the interior just looks incredible, both condition-wise and how it's been optioned, at least in my opinion. You may not like it and you're entitled to feel that way, but I think it has a lot of personality and it looks really good. Uh, so the back seat test, wow, very surprising. Uh, so I am 6'1", about 190 pounds. I have the front seat comfortably adjusted to my liking for driving. And I have quite a bit of legroom back here. I'm very comfortable. And if I had to be in this car for a road trip or something, I don't think I'd be mad about it. Uh, there's actually a pretty adequate amount of room back here. Uh, and it does have a charging port down there as well. Climate control, some carbon some niceties so yeah the back is actually extremely comfortable i was not expecting that it's a pretty average size sedan but um they they use the room pretty efficiently so that's good to know if you need to regularly transport yourself plus three adults you can swing that if you want to have like the fanciest uber in the world uh, so here we have our 5 liter V8, really neat intake cover, love the way that looks, blue top of the intake manifold, the carbon fiber pieces on the intake cover, this looks really nice, idle is incredibly quiet, it sounds really good. It's a really healthy drivetrain and it's so much fun to drive. It makes a lot of torque. It sounds phenomenal. Japanese V8s just have this unique sound uh, and that is a very good sound. Let me tell you, this car is pretty practical other than maybe fuel economy. Um, it's just packed full of luxury, comfort. It's super fun to drive and you put it in sport mode, suspension will tighten, the transmission will get more aggressive and it just becomes a really, really fun driving experience. So that is our 2019 Lexus GSF. If you have any further questions, please feel free to check out this vehicle on our website at exoticmotorsportsok.com. Thank you for watching.